What's up, yo? Welcome back to another video. And today we're gonna to talk about something that I think every setup must have, especially if you have a microphone, if you're a gamer, if you're a video creator, if you just join like normal Zoom calls, um, you probably wanna see this video. So a while ago, a company called IX Tech just sent me their microphone boom arm, and I've been using it for the past few weeks. And here's some of my thoughts and review of this boom arm. So if you wanna check this boom arm out, you make sure to use my link down below. Now, as soon as you open the box, you'll see an instruction menu, which I strongly suggest you to check it out, especially if you never installed a microphone boom arm before, like just like me. So it took me a hot minute, but it's all fine. Now underneath the instruction menu, there's this clamp, which should fit all of your table sizes. I think no matter how thick it is, there's also this horizontal arm that just connects to the clamp. Um, I'm not sure if you guys can see, like I'm talking about this horizontal arm. And obviously, as you can see, on top of it is just this vertical arm um, that's connecting the horizontal arm to the microphone uh, mount. Now, also, it came with a stick to raise the entire microphone like higher, but I just like to leave it like as a lizard, like that's why it's called a lizard boom on because it's like low profile so I don't want to make it too high and I just like to have a clean workspace and not be too cluttered. So yeah, as you can see, there's quite a lot of axes and boom arms and joints that can, so you can really play around with how you position the boom arm. You can like put it really high upwards like if you want to and you can also kind of lower it or you can like twist it left to right so no matter where you clamp this microphone at your table, it should have a spot that fits you. Now speaking of Lizard, the reason why I chose this specific model out of the two other like, um, I think it's called Hero and the other like the classic one is because I don't want to be like those typical streamer where the entire microphone like crosses the entire like frame. Like you probably know what I'm saying. So yeah, I think it just looks way much better if it's just, you know, keeping it low and not let everyone see how big your entire boom arm and microphone is. Now let's talk about some of my favorite part of this design. So first of all, the best lifesaver out there is it has actually have like a cable tray and a cover that can hide all of your cables. Like I have my hidden and you can't really see much cables around. I used to have this um, like mic stand that you can see the entire cable just round, running around the entire thing which is just an insane headache but now this one actually have this cover that allow you to run the cable beneath it which i think is pretty neat mine is in usb-c but obviously you can also if you have an xr cable this one should also be fine now another thing is i think it's called the a quarter inch screw adapter so if you don't have the right size for mounting a microphone on this boom arm um, you should be also be good because in the box you actually get like an adapter so no matter what kind of mic you are it should fit your setup and boom arm with no problem but yeah, overall i love how this small boom arm like this piece of tech like just kind of finishes this entire setup like i always felt there's something missing and like something that keeping me away from having like a i don't know finished minimal streamer gaming like productivity setup and yeah i can finally bring the mic closer to myself like um, i don't have to i used to just have the stand from the original like I usually just have this stand from the original mic, but now I can bring the mic much closer to me if I'm trying to talk to like friends, uh, talk to like um, like on Discord calls, on meetings, on doing voiceovers, etc., etc. So, yeah, this is very nice little small touch to it, and I think you won't go wrong if you go with the lizard model because you know like it to be minimalistic and it's especially important if you're using like a dynamic mic like what i'm doing to bring it closer to your mouth so the voice can be more rich and your skin will sound just a little bit more sexy but yeah that's my review of this microphone broom mom uh thank you again ix tech for sending this out to me and if you want to check it out check it out with the link and hopefully i'll see you in the next video